Bucks at Warriors, Junior Brown back with NBA Shot Clock on this Wednesday, March 6th with another free pick. And we're rocking with the under 226 in this Bucks Warriors game. Uh, we're going to ignore the Boston Massacre. Most of Golden State, as a matter of fact, Golden State don't, doesn't even have a starter that played 20 minutes in that game. That's how ridiculously bad they were in that matchup. So let's just ignore that. Other than that game, they've been elite uh, since the All-Star break. And that's come on the defensive end, not on, with their offense. Their offense is scoring at about just under 113 points per 100 possessions since the All-Star break, which is below average. Their defense, however, is at 104 points per 100 possessions, which is elite. So just to give everyone context, Minnesota is number one in the NBA with a, in defensive rating at 108. Golden State, since the All-Star break, it's only a six-game sample size, uh, are at 104. The number one defense in the league since the All-Star break have been the Bucks, though, at 101, which is a crazy number. And a lot of that has to do with their transition defense, which I think is going to be a huge factor in this game because Golden State has been getting out and running. They're playing at, playing at one of the faster paces in the league in the last two weeks at about 101 uh, possessions per game. Milwaukee's closer to the bottom five in pace at about 95-ish. I think Milwaukee's going to try and force their pace, especially if Giannis doesn't play because Giannis is the ultimate weapon in transition. Without him, they, they don't even have a reason to run if you look at the makeup of their lineup. Whereas Golden State, that's how they're going to make up for their currently subpar half-court offense by getting out and getting transition baskets. I think Milwaukee, what they've done is a banded offensive rebound to send numbers back and protect their basket, which I think is going to be a factor. And both team defenses are going to continue to play at a high level tonight. Give me the under 226. And let's cash yet another ticket, y'all.